Ladies and gentlemen, I regret to inform you that the sunny disposition of mine you've come to know and love will not be on display today. There will be no smiles, there will be no laughter, because I am in a state of extreme annoyance. Let me explain. Earlier today, I was shooting a video, like I normally do, and I heard a beep emanating from my house. I've searched everywhere and I cannot find the source. It is driving me How convenient. It's driving me nuts. But using the resources I have available, I intend to get to the bottom of this. I'm gonna find this phantom beep and I'm gonna bring you along for the ride. Because if I don't and this persists into the night, I'm gonna have to move. And I don't wanna do that because my girlfriend and I just moved in here a couple months ago. I've searched the obvious places and ruled them out. I even wrote a song about the experience. I'm looking for a phantom beep. beep. Where could it be? Where? Is it in the kitchen? Is it in the smoke detector? Is it in the toilet seat? Is it in the shower? Is it in the bed? Or is it all in my head? None of these things are creating the sound, and what makes this especially tricky is that the beeps seem to go off in random intervals. Sometimes it's five minutes between them, sometimes it's 15 minutes. And no matter what room I'm in, it seems like it's coming from somewhere else. So I've got a couple working theories. Number one, there is a robot that lives in the walls and is moving around. And number two is this is all in my head and the pressure of trying to appeal to the YouTube algorithm has finally broken me. But I've got a plan that should help me find some answers. I went to my local music store and rented eight of the exact same microphones, one for every available input in my recording system. What I'm gonna do is set them up in every room in the house and set them to the exact same the exact same levels. Press record, wait until the beep goes off, and see which track recorded it the loudest. This should help me narrow down the source, and if I need to, I'll do it again in the smaller space. Now the microphones I'm using are called C1000s, and they're typically used to record drum overheads. There are different directional ways that microphones can record sound. This is called the polar pattern. Some microphones pick up what's right in front of them. That's called a cardio pattern. Some microphones pick up in front and behind. This is called bi-directional. And some microphones pick up all around, which is called omnidirectional. Now, ideally today, I would be using omni mics. These are the exact opposite. It should still work though, because it does pick up a little bit of what's around. Now, the only reason I went with these is because they were the only types of mic that the store I went to had eight of. I've got plenty of cable, eight microphone stands. Give me a minute, I'll go set these up. <laughs> Cables running everywhere throughout my house. Next up, set up a Pro Tools session and wait for that beep. We've got ourselves a fairly big update here. On most of my tracks, there is nothing but various house noises. However, the back door and the kitchen picked up the beep. So right away, we can eliminate a bunch of these options. And if I zoom right in there, you definitely can see that the back door is louder than the kitchen. We are one step closer to solving this mystery. I'm going to go set up the microphones in the back door in a circular pattern, which should give us a fairly precise location. As you can see here, each of these microphones is pointing in a different direction. Bathroom, closet under the stairs, the other closet where I hang up my hockey equipment, and where we hang up our jackets. Time to wait for that beep again, see where it leads us. Looking at these waveforms, it would seem that the source of this beep is under the stairs. So I've got a new theory here and I no longer think that I'm going crazy. This closet here was filled with a bunch of junk from the previous tenants since before we even moved in. We never ended up going through it and ended up just chucking our stuff on top of it. So I'm thinking at the bottom of this junk pile, we're gonna find our mystery beep. I mean, in here is a microwave. I don't even know what this is. Concrete, paint, workout mats. Oh. 
Holy. Holy sh**. Holy fucking sh**. Sh**. I just found a basement. Holy sh**. Holy f Okay, this is pretty creepy. I had no idea this place existed. Okay, nobody's sleeping down here. That's a positive. Ho ho ho! Look at this. There's a carbon monoxide detector down here. I guarantee you. I guarantee you this is the source. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the mystery beep. There are some beer cans. I suspect the last tenants. Oh, a knife. That's creepy. I suspect the last tenants or the landlords were doing some work down here. Had a couple frosty cold ones. I also suspect they haven't changed the battery in this carbon monoxide detector for ages. So that's what we're going to do now. Well, that was a bit anticlimactic. It's just a boring old carbon monoxide detector. However, I did discover I have a basement here. What I'll do with this new information has yet to be seen. But uh, yeah, I guess that's the end. See ya. I found the phantom beep. I also found a basement. I also found some beer cans, I also found a knife, and I didn't find anything 